What's up, YouTube? This is now Mulan. I started, you know, to do this brand new video. Yeah, I know a lot of y'all wondering about my thumb thumbnail curse. What, what could this title be about, you know? So I decided to do this video, you know, let y'all, my subscribers and my future subscribers to the channel, know more about me. You know, things happen in life to us that, you know, we aren't planning for, really don't know how we would deal with it, but, you know, we have to deal with it, you know. If it's in God's will, if it's God's plan, then that's what we have to do. So, you know, um, like the end of 2019, um, you know, my mother, you know, she was battling uh, dementia. If anybody don't know what dementia is, it's a form of Alzheimer's, you know, and um, she lost her battle with dementia, but something that I wasn't prepared for was that the circumstances that happened towards the end of 2019, you know, my brother, he had, um, you know, become sick, had, um, what they call it, uh, lung disease. And the circumstances that happened afterwards was very shocking to me. Where that my brother passed, then the following week, that Saturday, you know, I talked to my my nephew from Charleston, South Carolina. I talked to him, and he was telling me that. He said that my mother passed. She was in a nursing home. And, you know, one thing about I see that nursing homes is that it's a hard decision, you know, having to put a parent in a nursing home. You know, and even though I didn't have a hand in that decision, which that I couldn't understand that fact. So after the <sighs> the, the the hard decision of having to do that because, you know, I didn't know nothing about dementia. I, you know, was at my end with. So, you know, it was a meeting with the uh, pastor, you know, my brother. And, you know, the decision was made for her to go into the nursing home. So, I was shocked because me, I really didn't want my mother to be in a nursing home because I feel that I would have done like I've been doing, sacrificing, you know, my my world as I know it to take care of my mother. You know, so as I was preparing for my mother's, you know, funeral, um that Sunday, the next day, I just happened to be relaxing at a cousin's house and, you know, looked on Facebook. And I seen everybody join cheers, you know, uh, the, the angel emojis on Facebook. And I said, what's going on? So... A couple of people texted me on Facebook and said, I'm sorry, but your nephew was killed in a car crash. I'm like, what? Are you for real? You know, I thought everybody was punking me, you know, but they said, sorry, you know, but it's not a joke. So, you know, the shock ain't having to deal with your brother's death on top of your mother dying next week. On top of that, your nephew dying after that, it was like one, 
by one by one. So in a short three-week span, the last three members of my family have passed on. And, you know, I'm not going to lie, YouTube, I was shocked, brokenhearted, you know. Um, I was in a place that I didn't think I was going to come out of. But thanks to, you know, close friends and my beliefs in God and my beliefs in myself, I was able to come out of that. So me sharing that story with y'all is to tell you that no matter what life throws at you, you know, you can rise above anything. No matter how hard dropping it may be, you know, you could come out of it. So, you know, a lot of things that I wanted to say to my family, especially my nephew, you know, he was a, he was a young man, very talented. You know, I wish that he could have seen me doing YouTube, something we talked about for years and when he was on earth. So, you know, I had to get accustomed to being without a family, being without a nephew, being without a brother, you know, being without a mother. You know, I had to get used to all that. You know, I used to get holidays, but not having no family to celebrate the holidays with, I had to get used to that. I haven't really got used to it, but, you know, I prepared myself that I'm in a nation of one. You know, and this, this video is mainly telling anyone that lost family, lost a loved one, lost a brother, lost a friend, that at first, it will be hard, but as time go by, you will realize that they're looking down at you. Every type of decision that you are making, they are helping you in every way. You know, and I decided to make this video that hopefully that people would understand that no matter what life throws at you, what type of trials, tribulation, life throws at you, you can come up, you can raise up, you can push on, even as hard as it will be to push on, you can push on. And notice that those loved ones are looking down at you like angels in heaven, guiding you in every step of the way. My name is Namulain. If you like this video, comment, subscribe. Turn that post notification bell on. To my next video, YouTube. One love.